live in Melbourne and Geelong from the Deakin Edge at Federation Square. In October 2019, Community Television celebrates its 25 years existence in Australia. It started 16th of October 1994 in Melbourne. But before that, on the 7th of October, it started in Perth. So a few days before Melbourne started its first ever broadcast of community television in Australia. So 25 years, we will celebrate that in Melbourne on the 5th of October with a great occasion of an event which called Antennas. An Antennas event is an event which is honoring community television's effort to make good service for the Australian people. Service which is made by the community to the community. Let's see what sort of nominations West Television achieved for the Antenna Awards. Congratulations to the nominees for Best Music Program for the 2019 Antenna Awards. Pass the song along. The Best Music Program is a wonderful half an hour documentary of people who believe singing together is gives them more than pleasure, it gives them the future and the present and the enjoyment of working together in the communities. Congratulations to the nominees for outstanding contribution to community by a program. Vibe Nation, stop the violence. As we can see, We've seen the uniqueness of the African people. Their brilliance, their beauty, their intelligence, and the importance of their cultural heritage, which they are sending back to their younger generation. And their younger generation are upholding this, as you all can see, with the cultural dances and every activities they are taking part in. I hope you have enjoyed today's episode of Vibe Nation. Thank you, it's Tony ETC. Congratulations to the nominees for Best Journalism in a Program. 2019 Night of Stars Dance Sport Championships, Undercurrent. Construction Row 8, John and Marlon Zilster, Undercurrent. Two of them is for journalism, the best journalist. There has been extensive controversy, not just over the construction of Row 8, but of the behaviour of police and protesters at the site. West TV have uncovered unseen footage from the Coolabup construction, which raises concerns about the continued presence of asbestos in the area and for the health and safety of police, protesters and workers alike. In just a few short weeks, ballroom dancers from all over the country will be coming to Perth to compete at the Night of Stars Championships. I'm joined here by some very talented young people at Dale Fraser's dance studio in Morley who are going to be training hard leading up to the big day. So that's three nominations for two different categories for undercurrent, what you just now watching. And we are happy to announce that's something which we never achieved for one program having three nominations. And the third one in the trail of undercurrent is the Youth Personality of the Year, which is our 14 years old roving reporter on Undercurrent and her story on the needles in the strawberries. I'm here in Fremantle at the Strawberry Festival 2018 cappuccino strip to support all the local farmers and all the strawberries that are being sold and even are going for free. There's face painting, there's fun activities for the family and very, very delicious food. Every year, in an average, including our existence of 10 years on air, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten awards from community broadcasting in some shape or form. And this year, we are happy to announce that WTV is selected in four categories with five different awards shortlisted. The first run of the Community Television Awards was organized by CBAA, which is the Community Broadcasting Association of Australia. Then after the CBAA Awards, Community Television in Australia, Melbourne, Sydney, Adelaide, Perth, 
with Brisbane, decided to establish their own community awards for broadcasting. It's called Antennas. That was Tibor reporting on Antenna Wars 2019.